I thought if it's all right with you to start off and actually do some magic for everyone. We're gonna do a little something called visualization. This is happening with a guru right here. It's amazing to have a little bit of an insight into your mind right now. This is actually pretty crazy. I think uh, in some way unknowingly, you're sowing the seeds of spirituality. All right, so first of all, thank you so much for having me and Lau giving me the opportunity to do this, thank you. And I thought if it's all right with you to start off and actually do some magic for everyone. Oh yeah. Okay, everyone, yeah, sounds good, okay. So I brought along a copy of your book. And we're just gonna randomly bookmark a page. So Sadhguru, just say stop whenever you want. Stop. Right here, great. So what's gonna happen, I'm gonna show you this page and I want you to memorize the page number and the first word at the top of the page. That's all you're gonna do. I'm gonna turn around, everyone keep me honest over here. So here we go, so just take a look. Keep me honest, memorize the page number. Mm. You got it, and the first word. Mm. All right. <laughs> Perfect. So this is, this is where it gets really fun. We're gonna do a little something called visualization, which I'm, I'm sure everyone here kinda knows what that is. <laughs> So what's going to happen is, again, we're going to do a little exercise, because I believe that if you can visualize something strongly enough in your mind, we can do some fun stuff. So we're just going to go for the page number. And this is, this is happening with a guru right here. So this is, I'm sure it can be pretty, pretty pro profound. So let's just try this. We're going to go for the page number. So I'm going to close my eyes. And in your mind, I want you to visualize the first number of the page number. Just visualize sending that to me. Do that right now. Six? Is it a six? Is that correct? Yeah. Okay. Thank you, yeah. <laughs> we'll go for the next one. So I'm going to close my eyes again. If you can visualize now the last number. Yeah. I think I got it. I think the page number you're thinking of is 68. Is that correct? <laughs> is that it? Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> It's not him, I'm transmitting it powerfully. <laughs> we're we're going to take this to another level. <laughs> and we're going to go for the word this time. Mm -hmm. That's very easy. It's very easy. So we're going to go for the words. I'm going to close my eyes. I want you to visualize sending the word. <laughs> I've got to say, it's, it's amazing to have a little bit of an insight into your mind right now. This is actually pretty crazy. Yeah, I've, uh, <laughs> I've thrown it out. <laughs> All right, so we'll go for, let's go for the word. Think about the word. And it has to do with, um, with a, it has to do with a thing, <laughs> but it's not, it's not a specific thing. It's, it's it could of be, course something. Yeah, it, <laughs> it, it could be it, many things. It's, it's something. That's the word, something, is that correct? I already said it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for participating, that was fun. All right, so, now as a magician for me, obviously, everything I do is about perception. And when you, when you talk about perception, it really fascinates me. Because when I perform, I try to create a shift in perception for my audiences and a transformative experience for them. And so my question to you right now is, what is to you, the practical difference between perception and reality? The word uh, perception is uh, used in social transaction as uh, my perception versus your perception. That means my distortion versus your distortion. <laughs> the word perception is not supposed to have anything to do with a particular individual. Perception means to be able to grasp what's there the way it is. If reality enters you without distortion, that's proper perception. Rest is distortion. So, in a way, what you're doing is to be able to effectively distort their perception. Mine too <laughs> For a period of time, 
and this is fine. It's wonderful because uh, it's intrigues and fascinates everyone, entertains everyone. As you're a stand-up magician, <laughs> I can call you that. It's wonderful to make people see how fragile or how inconsistent or how unreliable their own perception is. The more and more people see that their perception, the way their perception is right now, is not reliable. It can be just taken for a ride, just like that. I think uh, in some way unknowingly, you're sowing the seeds of spirituality. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> okay, good <laughs> It's very important that the young people should bring this into their lives, that you don't look up to anything, nor do you look down on anything. You don't suck up to anything, nor do you spit on anything. Just learning to accept life as it is. This is perception, seeing the reality just the way it is. If you look at life just the way it is, you will see every leaf in this tree is unique. Every human being sitting here is unique. Every little thing in the existence is absolutely unique. If you experience the uniqueness of life, it'll never get old for you, nor will you get old for this world. <laughs>